Good morning. Oh, I know I'm really late this morning, huh? It's after 11 a.m. on the East Coast, but I thought I should go ahead and pop on here anyway to make my coffee. Um, I was up most of the night with Grayson because he had an upset tummy. I gave him this special kind of treat yesterday, and I guess it didn't agree with him. So I had to stay up with him and um, take him out multiple times in my Mickey Mouse nightgown. <laughs> um, I was the only one out there, stayed in the street lights and by the apartments of people who I know. Uh, didn't see another soul. But anyway, so this morning he started to kind of calm down some. So we both went to sleep on the sofa together. But I'm going to go ahead and make myself some coffee. I'm going to make some Costa Rica. My favorite color. Because, you know, the one thing about drinking caffeinated beverages is that uh, if you suddenly have a day when you neglect to have any, you can get some withdrawal symptoms. You can get a headache. So I would like to avoid having a caffeine headache. I've got here my lovely little bone china cup from the bee's knees which is a British shop in Massachusetts. And I love drinking out of this mug. So the Nespresso is going into some almond coconut milk, which I'm gonna put back in the fridge. And the little saying that I have on my Facebook banner today is really going to apply to me for sure. If you want fast acting relief, slow down. Try slowing down. And that's what I'm going to do today is to slow down and relax. You know, so often people say, well, I need to just calm down. I need to relax, but I have so much to do. And they'll say, well, um, let me get this stuff done. And then when I start feeling like, you know, I'm ready to relax, that's when I'll relax. Well, let me tell you a little hint. Okay. The little hint is, if you want to change how you feel, change what you're doing. So if you want to feel more relaxed, stop what you're doing, slow down, do something relaxing, mm -hmm, and you will feel relaxed. You know, um, I used to do a lot of things because I would feel motivated and with my motivation would come lots of energy and I would get things done and then I realized that if I sometimes I didn't have motivation it was so hard to get things done but you know what if instead of sitting and waiting for the feeling of motivation to come over me if I started, if I got up and started doing some things, well, that motivation would usually follow and it would change how I felt and I would start to get things done. Well, this morning I'm gonna demotivate. <laughs> I'm gonna sit on the sofa with Grayson and drink my coffee. Where is that boy? Let me see, I'll show you Grayson this morning. Oh, there he is. See, he's kind of droopy. He hasn't touched his water. I haven't given him any food. 
And dogs are smart because when they are feeling under the weather, they don't eat or drink, you know? They give their body a rest, unlike people, you know? So he's gonna rest until he feels up to eating and drinking, and that's good. And meanwhile, when I go over to the sofa, he'll come with me. <sighs> Costa Rica with almond coconut milk. That makes me relax. I love that flavor. Well, anyway, so listen, I know this is not very long today and doesn't have a whole lot of content for you, but maybe this will, maybe there's somebody listening who needed to hear this to slow down. Give it a try. God bless you. I'll talk to you maybe later. Tomorrow, anyway.